Hey everybody, this is Melvin with Tech Around 24-7. Today we want to do a quick video on how to free up space or storage on your device. The device I'm using here is a Galaxy S7 Edge. And uh, like I said, I just want to use this as, a, as an, an example on how to free up storage. First thing you need to do though is go to your settings and check and see how much space you actually have free on your device. And now on my phone here, I just need to go over to systems, go to storage, and my device internal storage is 32 gigs. Now this varies from phone to phone. Mine is 32 gigs and it shows here that I have used 28.92 gigabytes. So that roughly means I have 3.08 gigs free and it's my recommendation that you should always keep anywhere from 1 to 2 gigs free on your storage on your device storage internal storage so your phone can uh, perform correctly because if you go any lower than 1 gig then it may start to malfunction or not perform like it should so I have 3. 08 gigs free and of course you see I have a memory card also that's a 32 gig which you know it shows how much free space I have on it anyway come out of that there's many ways to free up space but the one thing I want to show you the one way I want to show you is by using Google Drive so you can go to your Google folder and of course I'm using an Android device and a lot of times on the Android devices they have a Google folder and we want to use this particular app which is called Google Drive. Now Google, Google Drive is a cloud storage through Google and of course Google is Gmail. And most people don't know though if you have a Gmail email address you automatically get about 15 gigs of free storage through Google so in getting that free you might as well use it. So what we want to do is I'm going to show you how to uh, create a folder in Google Drive and a lot of times your storage is eaten up by pictures and videos. So I'm going to show you how to move some of those pictures to your Google Drive and that will help you free up space on your internal storage. So to uh, create a folder, Google Drive, we're going to hit the plus hit folder and we're going to name this fun 24-7 say ok so that created that folder fun 24-7 we're going to hit a home button to come out of that now we're going to go into our gallery and look at photos we're going to go into this download folder and I got a few pictures from my channel and I'm going to show you how to move pictures into your Google Drive folder. So just hold down one picture, select it, and we're gonna we're gonna do two. We're gonna do that one and this one here. So we have two photos selected. Now we need to go up here and hit share and it'll give you some uh, some choices to make. And we, of course we want to go to save and drive and it goes to drive is to show you the, the pictures that you've chosen that you want to save in the drive scroll up a little bit to make sure that you put it in the right folder of course it's going to show your account and my gmail address is techrunner247 at gmail.com and it shows a folder but that's not the correct folder so we want to hit that and at the top here is where you can choose the folder you hit that arrow there and it shows all the folders you have available in your drive so we're going to go to fun247 we've selected it we chose that and then at the bottom hit select folder so it showed it as being selected you go back here again you see tech running 24 7 at gmail and the folder is fun 247 go ahead and hit save and as you see that prompt it says uh, two photos are being saved into tech 24 tech running 24 7 into the fun 24 7 app excuse me fun 24 7 folder so what we want to do is we want to check, pull up, pull up, do a pull down menu to see if it's still loading. We don't see it in there. 
going to come out of that then we're going to hit Google Drive again to go back and look we're going to hit the fun 24 7 folder and there are our pictures the two pictures are there so hit your home button again we're going to go back to the gallery and what we're going to do is delete those hold that same picture down and then and then hit delete now that is deleting it from our device those pictures are no longer there but just to show you that you still have them hit a home button again we're going to go back to the google folder hit google drive and if you hit this and to show you all the folders but we hit the fun 24 7 and the pictures over there so you still have the pictures they're just no longer stored on your device itself now say for instance you want to get that picture back on your device you can actually touch on the picture while you're in google drive and this is just a special function that samsung has if you do a, a palm swipe like that it took a picture and if you go back to your gallery again it saved that picture in your screenshots screenshots so the main thing is to know that when you save those pictures in the Google Drive, those pictures are stored away on Google servers. And then you just need to go back into your gallery and delete them. So you will no longer have them. So that comes in very handy, like if you're taking a bunch of pictures on vacation, birthday party, whatever the function is, you take like 50 pictures. So you can go in your gallery, select all those pictures, put them in a folder in the Google Drive, and then go back and delete them off your phone. And that's the way you would free up space on your device. So that's it for our video today. Hopefully um, what we shared with you is something that you can use and, and uh, come in handy on freeing up space on your device. That's it for our video today. Please subs hit subscribe. And also share this video with your friends. And uh, again, this is Melvin with TechRun 24-7. We look forward to seeing you in our next video. Thanks.